Hi Tubies, it's your girl Red Diamond and I'm about to do a relaxer in my hair and I'm going to show y'all how I do mine and I only use triple grow products in my hair and this is the only type of relaxer that I use and it is um regular regular relaxer I use all the triple grow products um, as you can see my hair has grown like so so much from before it is it's grown a lot um, since I've been using these products and after I do my perm and wash it out I'm going to show you the after and I'm going to also show you the products that I use and in the order that I use them so I'm going to get started and you already know the video might be sped up now some of you may use Vaseline um, on your edges and stuff me I don't because it really don't burn me and I don't have to leave my perm in for like a long long time the first thing use gloves you want to use some kind of gloves if you're allergic to latex they have plastic gloves and they have rubber gloves with no latex so I just parted down the middle first of all I'm going to start with my edges I always start with my edges now everybody might not do theirs the same but this is how I do mine and I'm just doing a basic you know root touch up and everything I won't put it over cover every single part so this is how I do mine if I'm looking up I'm, my mirror is right behind here So like I said, I go over the back, the side edges. I just make sure I get my edges really, really good because that's the one thing that I worry about the most since I do wear wigs at times. And I only use like, I know I probably got it on my, <laughs> I only use like so much. I don't use a whole, whole gob of of uh, perm some people slap it on so thick I try not to and I get my perm every hmm every about every six months is when I do mine and make sure you get on the top after good. this one I have this little thing of perm I've used maybe at least about five or six times so yeah perm for me goes a long way it lasts a while so after this this will be probably the end of it and I will have to get another one but that's fine with me because like I said it goes a long way with me and you want to just smooth the edges and I take my comb and go over it as well and just comb through gently and you always use a wide tooth comb because if you use a skinny comb trust and believe it's going to pull your hair out and see I just go through this and with without even having to put a lot of perm on that part it gets the, the same straight. thing with the back and the side just get the edges and comb up and I leave mine in I wash my perm out in the shower so that's what I'm about to do take my shower wash my perm out um, I try not to leave it in too long everybody's different some people may require 20 minutes some people may require 30 35 but I don't recommend leaving it in no longer than 35 minutes <laughs> and see how straight my hair is already so and then I just kind of comb it all together and just kind of smooth it out smooth it out real good 
so I'm gonna go and let this sit and I will be back after my shower to show you how I um what products I use and everything and I do have a um, videos already showing you my products but I'm gonna show them again because I have a lot of new subbies and you might not want to go through and look for all them videos <laughs> so straight already so um I will be back okay See you guys you should go red and I'm back just had my shower and everything um this is my hair after the shower and this is the difference. Whew, it feels a lot better too, y'all, for real. Still has that length, except it's a lot straighter. So, the products I use, I've been using the same products for years. Triple Grow by Black Sassy, that's all I use. And this is the tea tree oil. And uh, this is the original formula, just the hair grease. Y'all can see that. Is that, and this is the for anti-breakage. This is the cream grow. Is that? And this is the anti-thinning herbal grow. And then you have the anti-shedding healing serum. Anti-shedding healing serum. Then finally, you have the root stimulating um, and moisturizing growth spray. And I also have the shampoo and the conditioner to go with it. It's in the bathroom. I didn't bring it out the shower with me because I leave it in the bathroom. And it's um, a bottle of shampoo, and then the um, conditioner is like a container like this, but it's um, a lot bigger. And they have the leave-in conditioner. That's the only product of theirs that I don't like, and it's only because of the smell. So everything else of theirs I use. So what I do is just comb my hair all to one side. And um, I start with the tea tree oil. The, yeah, the tea tree oil, the original formula. And what I do is, I ain't gonna have time to do all that on camera, but I do this, the grease first, and then I take a small amount of the anti thinning and I rub it like on my edges and like wherever your real, real thin spots are. It just, and mine is in the top, but it has grown out, so. It was in the top, but using this has grown out, so I rub a little bit of this on there. Then I take a small amount of this and put it in my palm, and this is the anti-breakage cream. And I just take it and rub it on my hair so it won't break off. And then I take the anti-shedding and I do the same thing, just a small amount. A lot of this stuff, just a little bit goes a long way. I'm tell me. I mean, trust me, I'm telling you. So just a little bit of this in the palm of your hand and rub it on all of your hair. Finally, the um, root stimulating growth spray. And I just take it, I spray it around my edges and I also spray it like um, in my hair. And I just rub it and I when I put this on I just rub real good. That's the final step and I just massage my scalp really, really good with this. And then after that, I just either, I let it air dry. I don't put no heat on my hair at all. No heat. I don't do, the only heat is hot water, <laughs> warm water. I don't use blow dry, I don't use curling out, or none of that on my hair. And I'm telling you, my hair has grown so, so much. So much. If y'all um, have been keeping up with me during my hair care journey and everything, y'all would know, like, my hair was short. And it was really thin and the top and everywhere. And I'm so proud of my hair. And I ordered all my products. You can get these some of the products at your local beauty supply store. But I ordered mine offline from a beauty supply store online. And I, 
SMBC hair. I don't I don't remember the name of them, but I'm sorry. But Triple Grow by Black Sassy. And I'm gonna grease my scalp. So see y'all.